Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. My name is Marcus and today's topic will be another user request. One of my followers asked me how can they delete empty folders. I've already made a video about how to get all the empty folders of a library and now we'll just continue on this to delete them. First I've created a new uh, document library and I will create some folders so we can work that. So we have folder one, this will be an empty folder. Then we have folder two. Within this folder, we will just create a Word document. Just waiting a bit. Okay, that's saved. Let's reload this. Yeah, so. And then we'll create a folder free. And this folder has a subfolder one. The subfolder one will be empty and the subfolder two um, will contain an Excel sheet. So what our flow will do is now it should delete the folder one, leave the folder two as it is because it's not empty, leave folder three because it has subfolders in it, but it should delete the subfolder one, which is empty again. Well then let's get to Power Ultimate and start it. I've made a copy of one of my Power Ultimate flows that gets all the empty folders and I will just use this as base to start from there and just continue to delete the files. I'll just go through with you the workflow again just in a very quick way. If you want to have more details just use the link in the description, watch the video, it's a bit more detailed there. But I'll just go quickly through it. First I'll need to initialize a variable, an array, that will collect all the empty folders. Then I will use the get files properties only action to get all the folders within the library. Then I will use an apply to each function on this array that will list the uh, that will list the contents of the folder in the current uh, of the current item. If the result of this action is empty, so if this is empty, true then it will append to the array a variable. Let's just test this quickly. And in the end, I put in a compose that just lists all the empty folds. I have the folder one and the subfolder one. These are the two really empty folders uh, in this library. And what I also get when I look at the get files properties only action and I look at the show raw inputs, I'll get the table ID. I will need this to delete the folders. So I'll just make a copy of this one. Go back to edit. After this append to array variable action, I will add another action. I will go to standard, then SharePoint, and search here for delete. You have delete file and delete item. Your first uh, reaction would be, it is in a document library, I'll use delete file, because also within the folders and so on. Unfortunately, that does not work. Um, Microsoft does not yet have a distinct action to delete folders, so we'll need a delete item. We'll use the site address and the list name. Here we come to the next problem. It really only lists regular lists and not document libraries. But in SharePoint, also document library is a list. And we can go around this problem by entering the custom value. 
and use the folder, uh, no, the document library ID as the list name. And as the ID, I will use the ID of the current item within the loop. And then I will test this again. Run flow. It will take a few seconds. Finished. So now I go back to my document library. I refresh the page. And as predicted, it deleted the folder one that was totally empty. It left the folder two. And it deleted the subfolder one and left the subfolder two. So that is how you delete empty folders from a document library. I hope I could help you. If you have any more questions, just leave it in the comments and I wish you a great day.